Hey everybody. So let's take a look at our cache that we, uh, or our stash that we found here at the uh, uh, Volkswagen only salvage. Uh, we went down to today, uh, just got back into town here about 45 minutes ago. And uh, it's a Volkswagen only salvage. Sorry about that. Somebody always wants to call me when I'm making videos. So we'll take, shut that off. Okay, so this is what we got. First off, we got a bumper skin. Again, this is from Way Out Salvage. It's a Volkswagen only salvage yard. And I'll you know, kind of give a little shout out to Way Out Salvage. If you need anything for a Volkswagen, uh, Bug, Beetle, Bus, Van, Vanagon, Jetta, uh, Volkswagen, uh, what, Carmagia, um, Thing, uh, if anything VW. Uh, they've got it. So, uh, and of course, I'm going to put some videos up of our little field trip. So that's where we went today. We got our uh, skin, our uh, rear bumper skin. It's not in perfect shape, but well, neither is the car that we're putting it on. And we got that. We're going to put that on our uh, uh, Volkswagen Jetta diesel. We got the uh, inner bumper body or frame, and we just needed a skin. So we're going to put that on there we've also got uh, this is a um, headlight uh, wire plug this is for what the driver's side I think so the driver's side headlight uh, is damaged so we got that we got our dash piece here um, ours on our car is damaged right in here and so the headlight control would go in one of these spots and these pieces in here is all busted so if you push on the headlight too hard it'd go inside the dash and you gotta fish it back out so we got one of these we got a passenger tail light assembly and we got that for so what did we pay for that twenty dollars we paid for that which considering the only other salvage i found that had a jetta they were wanting eighty five so we got that. And the reason why we're replacing that on this car, let's see if we can show it here. Well, it's all taped up, but here we go. It's all, get out of the shadow here. It's all busted here. Uh, so whenever it rains or you go through a car wash or any of that, it gets down inside the assembly and corrodes the wire or the socket and just causes all kinds of heck. I've been pulled over in this car a dozen times if I've been pulled over once for tail light out so that's gonna solve that problem also we got uh, uh, antenna assembly now that's actually two antenna assemblies put together the antenna whip is off of uh, those other Fox or uh, uh, huh? off of a golf. oh uh, off of a golf Volkswagen golf and then the other portion, the base and the wire, was actually off of a, a Jetta. Uh, we've got this, um, <clears throat> here's our headlight uh, switch. And ours, this uh, rotary dial don't work on ours. And uh, the uh, switch is damaged internally. So that sometimes you turn the headlights on, like that, and you'll be cruising down the road. And then all of a sudden, boop, there goes your headlights. So you have to cut that off wait a few seconds and cut it back on and I've been pulled over for that too by the local authorities and they think I'm screwing around with my headlights so anyway that goes in there and we bought this piece because the um, one on our car was damaged and you push that and it goes in the dash and we also got this speaker cover only paid a little bit for that nothing important but the one we have on the car didn't fit. It was off of another type of car and it wasn't even form fitted for the dash so it was uh, taped on the rest of the way. Now what we didn't get for the car that we did go after, and not because it probably wasn't out there, because it probably was, but I was spending some time making those uh, videos that will be posted hopefully today if not tomorrow. Um, and my friend was getting these parts, which I'll tell you about in a moment. But uh, here's what we, one of the things that I needed 
what we needed this is the uh, heater blower motor and uh, you know fan here for the uh, for the heater that one is non operational that's the one that actually came with this car uh, it don't work um, didn't find one out there that was the correct one so that will give me an excuse to go back um, it's about well almost a hundred miles from here uh, so but it was well worth it in my opinion now here's what uh, my friend got this is uh, parts that are going to go on to a 87 88 uh, Volkswagen Fox which is his most recent acquisition and we'll take a peek at that here in a moment uh, he needed uh, he bought the car for 200 um, so he needed this assembly here because uh, there's no way to shift the transmission properly the, the jerry rigging that the previous owners did is well laughable uh, so we needed this and subsequently the center console uh, to go with it so we've got all this together uh, we also got this striker plate for one of the rear doors uh, the one on his car is either damaged or non-existent <clears throat> okay yeah he uh, originally um, the Fox that we were getting parts for today uh, was actually at the salvage that we were getting parts off of for this car uh, during the make of uh, well earlier videos on this car so because we couldn't pull parts off of this car it's still a drivable vehicle um, well we went down to way out to get that <clears throat> also for uh, the Fox we got a radiator hose and that's just because I don't know well, we we're probably stupid and we could have got brand new radiator hoses from AutoZone for the same price but whatever we were there we found it we got it so anyway that's uh, what we got from way out salvage and again here's another shout out to way out salvage it's a Volkswagen only salvage yard um, anything has to do with Volkswagen um, buses vans vanigans bugs beetles Carmagias, things um, Jetta's trucks um, Volkswagen stuff I've never seen before they've got it uh, he also picked up some hubcaps uh, and hubcap hangers for the Jetta so anyway let's take a little well we'll make another video actually uh, later on on the uh, recent vehicle acquisition we'll just there it is Volkswagen Fox $200 cash purchased, well, in the process of being purchased, but $200, and that's a hopeful project he's going to fix and put on the road, and then this may very well likely become my car. So there's our, uh, there's our stash that we got today, bumper skin, dash, cover, bezel thing, whatever you want to call it, uh, passenger rear tail light assembly, speaker cover, uh, plug and wire assembly for the headlight, um, antenna assembly so that we can listen to some tunage, uh, radiator hose, center console with boot, shifter mechanism with actuational arm, striker plate for the door, and we did not get the fan blower motor assembly. Doesn't mean we won't. So that's what we got, and uh, it's a good salvage. So if anybody has any, uh, you know, questions, comments as to where it is, um, you're welcome to uh, post. Okay, one last thing before we end this video. There's the parts that we got today. Let's do a proper shout out. Way out salvage. Keep it alive by way out. If you want telephone address information, you can find it online at www.wayoutsalvage.com. You can Google it, or if you want a little more uh, uh, personal information as to my experience there, comment. And I can tell you from personal experience as of today, they've got a lot. So, thanks for watching. 
and we'll get these parts on our cars this one and the one down there and we'll get these videos uploaded thanks for watching